Okay, 2037 East Clovely. Sorry, I am doing the outside quickly because it is raining and I just heard some big thunder. So cul-de-sac down there. Really pretty. This house is huge. Very quiet, well-maintained street. Nice covered entryway. High ceilings. Very like fresh paint. I love, love, love these floors. So big windows here, it really brightens it up. Lots of unique ceilings and archways. I feel like this house has a lot of character. Formal dining. Okay, so I'm gonna take us to the right first, because this is not a whole lot going on this way. So you walk down the hallway, let's go to the very right. Come down this hallway, and we have a HVAC here and it's like little windows up top this is the first full bath it's the original tub shower and there is a little linen closet behind the door and bedroom number one so this is right at the front of the house. Love these big windows, high ceiling, unique shaped room, standard size closet. So that's where the front door is. We'll come back down this way. This is the master. Smart thermostat, so double doors leading into the master. Look at these ceilings. It's so pretty. I love their um, decor as well. Large sitting area. Slider leading out back. Okay, and then tile, once we enter the ensuite, we do have his and her closets. It's a smaller walk-in and then little linen and another small walk-in. There's carpet in the closets. Okay. So it looks like they updated the shower, but everything else looks original. Double vanity. It's kind of a little getting ready area. Shower is really pretty. It's nice, fun tiles. And water closet. Garden tub. Okay. Let's go outside really quick because I don't know if it's gonna start pouring again. Okay, so those are the windows from the entrance there. And this is a nice covered area. They have their TV set up out here. Some fans. It's a great covered space. You could have a full summer kitchen out here. And then this opens up and this part is caged in um you know the pool is small but it's really not it's really not that tiny and I love this little hot tub area it's kind of like tucked away probably like a two-person hot tub let's take a look out this way so this does back up to 
the pond and the golf course. So there is a cabana bath here. I'll show you that from the inside. All fenced in. Some nature for you. I mean, this is beautiful. And you actually have like a decent amount of yard, which is great. This is really pretty. I'm glad that it's not pouring. Okay. Double gates that lead into the side yard. Let's go back inside. Sorry, this is going to be definitely a longer video, um, but I want you guys to get the full effect. Okay. So let's circle back in through the master and see the rest of the home. That's it, we've gone down both sides of the hallway. We're back at the front door here. Again, love this. Okay, and they have this really nice kind of brick feature and wine cooler. So cute. So let's come out into the main kitchen area. This is like your little breakfast nook. You could put a table there. Big island. Look at this huge fridge. Well, love that. Pantry. Nice size pantry. Definitely have lots of cabinet space. Um, Stainless steel appliance, oh, all Bosch appliances. These are very high end. I mean, this is like stunning and I'm again, obsessed with their decor. <laughs> it's so bright and open. You've got your fireplace here. I mean, these windows just let in great amount of natural light. The views are to die for. And you can also get to the patio there from the sliders. Let's go down this little hallway here. We have full bath right here, linen closet. Shower, tub, nice size bathroom. And here is bedroom. This is the cutest loft bed I've ever seen. Looks like they took the doors off this closet. Great size room though, and it's very separate. It's kind of in its own little area over there, off the living space. And then right here, we have another full bath. This is what I would call the cabana bath because it does connect to the yard. So you could easily go through the yard and get to the pool around that sidewalk there. So a nice walk-in shower, tile floors. Um, linen closet here and another linen closet here. So double linen closets. Okay, walking back through the kitchen. This house is so big. Okay, so down this hallway, this does have a door to close off. Come through here and to the left, we have the laundry, nice utility sink. Lots of room in here. Little linen closet. It's a good size laundry. And big storage under the stairs. Goes back pretty far. And right here at the bottom of the stairs is the garage. They definitely have 
quite a bit of stuff in here. It looks like there's a closet back there. They have two refrigerators out here. Electrical panel. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Junction box. Um, like this storage up here, and they've got some nice hooks on the wall. Put your stuff on. Attic access. Okay, let's go upstairs. Um, carpet leading up. Carpet looks in good shape. Little window looking out to the side in the driveway there. And more stairs going up. So we're kind of at the second landing here. Got storage. They have a lot of stuff in here, but it goes back pretty far. And then there's a door, this little I don't know, I guess you could use it as storage. They have a desk and computer set up in here, but it's a small space. Up to the third landing. And this is some more storage. And this is also huge. This house definitely doesn't lack in storage space, closet space. More stairs up and this closes off. This is separate living bonus room, kind of like a little mini kitchenette. Very cool. So this is overlooking the pool and it's your view. Stairs leading up. They have a full like movie theater setup. This little kind of island bar area. Oh, wow. Okay. Great storage area. Kitchen. And a full bath. Nice size bathroom and a linen closet behind there. Okay, and let's go down the hallway here. Here is a little bedroom. Got bunk beds in here. And down the hall to the right, we have another bedroom. The cutest little kids' beds. I mean, this view, it's beautiful. So this is a Jack and Jill setup. His and her vanity space. Separate door, the closet, or shower, tub, water closet. And this is the other bedroom, a little bit smaller. Standard size closet also has an amazing view. So when we walk back out here, we're at the end of the hallway. Linen closet in here. And that's it.